my virtual friends, my name is Catherine, also known as Miss Blue, and welcome to The Cat and the Hijab. Now I'm guessing that you could probably tell what this game is about from looking at what's going on here, but I'm going to say so anyway. It's about a cat in a hijab who boards a subway train on her daily commute, and the interesting, and sometimes bad, interaction she has with other people on that there train. So, as you can tell from that description, this will deal with a lot of serious issues like racism, Islamophobia, sexism, all that kind of stuff. Which the HO page just tells about, but this is a free game for the Resistance Jam, and I thought I should play it because it looks very interesting. So, let's begin. Start. Okay, never mind. Sorry. Alright. Oh god, this is Go back to your own country. Great, we're gonna Great, great, we're gonna start with that one, aren't we? And I get to make choices as well. This is my country, why would you say that shame when you ignore him? That's the best way. Our new hairball and chief will deport all of your kind soon. Jesus Christ. Kiss your visa goodbye, you stupid terrorist. Wow. Wow, buddy. Uh, wow, just wow, dude. Like, I think it's frozen. Oh shit! Hang on, G game. Hmm. It did say that this might like not do it at like 1080, so I'm after. Oh jeez, I can tell you one of the. I can tell you're one of them by the scarf on your head. Uh. Uh, yeah. don't bluff, that's not gonna- uh, ignore him! You probably don't understand cat- cat- cat glitch? Stupid foreigner, oh god. Dude! Honestly. Can I don't just sit down, honestly? Yeah, just sit down. Jesus. Well then, we just got on a fucking train and this is already happening, god. It was like back when Brexit was going on. Good God, it was so bad for like anybody with that kind of- Dude, I, don't you dare. Back the fuck away, dude. I see you coming towards me. Oh, I feel bad. Don't you feel hot in that thing? Why did you approach me to tell me that? You should take it off. It's kind of like, uh, it's called a hijab. They wear it for a religious person. I don't know what it is. Uh, that one, I think. It's more than just covering one's head. Uh, I don't know what it's for, really. I didn't really learn about it that much. I, 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 don't, I don't think it's that one. It's about... I don't really know what it is for, but I'm going to guess it's this one. But I heard that's a symbol of repression. You don't need to wear it in this country. Um... It's my choice and I enjoy it for the freedom to wear it. No one has forced me to wear it, so why do you demand that I take off? I suppose, yeah, the top one. It's my freedom to wear. In some countries, a simple act of modesty is banned. That's repression too. Women don't need an another voice telling them what they can and can't wear. That's true. Oh, I never thought of it like that. Thanks for being patient. You're welcome. Huzzah, good conversation. I'm gonna fucking sit down and relax. Good, I thought that was that douchebag from earlier. Oh. So, today's not gone great, good god. Oh, do you remember the whole debacle when like Trump was elected president? All that happened then? Jesus Christ. It's so reminiscent of what's going on here, man, honestly. I mean, like, I've lived in like tiny towns or like in the countryside, so I don't like see this kind of stuff that often. Heck, I've only been on a subway like four times in my life, so. Never seen this before. After a few more stops, oh god. I thought you were an ugly woman, but you're really a man dressed in drag. Wh what? Who says that to people? Honestly. Talk to the cat saying and confront the har harasser. Start recording with a smart- Don't record it. Don't get involved, man. Recording it just wakes people off. Take that wig off, harasser grabs at the- At that. <laughs> Somewhat- Oh, right. Sorry. I thought that was at me for a second. Okay, uh- Get, confront the bastard, okay. Leave the person alone, I don't like it, nobody likes it. Hey, what What she wears is not up to you. Fuzz you, don't talk about my friend that way. Fuzz off and bring your bigotry with you. Uh, don't leave her alone. I don't like having this pervert on my subway. Men should act and dress like men. S since when are transgender people perverts? It's offensive to me, I don't want my children having to see this pervert. Good God, man, this is horrible. Your preferred days are over. Our newly elected grand hairball is going to make this country great again. Oh my god. Wow, those phrases, man. 
Looks morally despite the harasser continuing in the background. This is my stuff, I'm sure, I hope that this bigot won't follow me. Uh. Okay, uh, do, do you walk with her or just leave her to go? Stand up for yourself, stop being such a pussy, wow. Don't make the situation, don't make the poor person any sadder. Yeah, let's walk with them. Yes, you don't mind. You're welcome, oh God. You're welcome, pussy. <laughs> Not a phrase I thought I'd be yelling today. End conversation, okay. Oh boy. Huh. Do I remember learning about like the pussy right? That them uh, Russian lot. That protest. Those pro that protest group. Whew. So that was a good start, wasn't it? Let's go once more time so we can get anything new here. Oh, so this is our friend. I had no idea. I should have sat next to her. I'm an idiot. <laughs> oh, for fuck's sake, dude. I actually want to try and like the wrong way to do it, as in like just yelling back at him. Uh, why would you say that? Just trying to make, trying to make my country great again. That's my terrible American accent. All right. Uh, go fuzz yourself. Fuzz you. I've had enough of this. End conversation. Yeah, that's right, you bitch. Get out of here. Right then. Sit. Friend. No, 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 no. They are. I meant. Oh, fuck's sake. Sit next to your friend in this seat. There you go. Ah, things are better now. All right. So that was the first conversation. Swell so far. Not so terrified of this one anymore. Hmm. I don't want to be rude though, because like this one's okay. She's just asking. Ignore. All oh, right. Okay. Fine then. I, I stand wholly corrected. See, I said you should take that thing off. Uh. Uh. Oh Jesus. Do you take off your pants first? Right here. Right now. Yeah, bitch. Why you go? You're a loco. Get away from me. I'm crazy. Well, excuse you. You're the one who just walked up to somebody and said, hey, you should probably take that thing off. Honestly. Oh, man. Like, I saw some of the comments on the HTO page for this game as well, and they were just like, yeah, this happens, like, a lot. Not, like, occasionally, like, all the damn time, so. Oh, bad time to have li literally any religion in, the, in this day and age, honestly. It's tough, I imagine. Now here comes the most horrible one with the having a go at the friend. I see you, sir. Right then. Yeah, shit. Start recording with a smartphone, bitch. Your phone's out of battery. God damn it. Uh, that's probably not the greatest thing to do as well. Get off it. Get off the way, dude. Get, confront the bit. Uh, yeah, leave the person alone. Uh, what's Fuzz off and bring your big, uh, take your bigotry with you. So the Muslim is de defending the drag queen. Fuzzing libtards. What? Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't want to say that. I don't, uh, it's an option, so I might as well explore what it means. Uh, maybe you're right. Oh, I don't say that. <laughs> I told her to not be such a coward, basically, and said, oh yeah, you're right, I guess, but no. <laughs> That's not the way to do it, but for a game made in a week, this is great. I mean, like, obviously, it's like, God, it's horrible. Like, huh. maybe it's just like a Scotland thing. Like, I, don't, I haven't seen this that much, like, being in Glasgow a fair few times, being on the subway a fair few times, never seen this kind of thing, so... I don't know, man. I can't really say anything. I don't see this stuff often enough to know about it, but still. At least I'm taller, I guess, so, man. Oh, I, don't, I don't know why I do some videos like that to me, but still. There's not much to say, really, I guess. It's like, you can play this game for yourself. It's on itch.io. A uh, completely free game as well, so I'll leave a link in the description if you want to play it for yourself, but man. What do you even say, man? Like, I'm sure a lot of you out there are, are tolerable of these kind of things and will stand up for people who are having this kind of harassment, so good on you if you do that thing and if you're not, well then, I don't know why you're here, I guess, so just away with you then, I suppose, but uh, I, I should probably just like end it here, just like don't, don't bother trying to say anything else, end it here, great little game showcasing a terrible thing that's happening in modern society right now. And leaving countries out of this, at least that's for sure, so.
let's just end it there. Thank you all so kindly for watching and I hope to see you in the next one. See you later. Be more taller over out there. Just being nice to people is easier than being mean.